Hey guys, this time in Nugget Knowledge, we are showing you how light bulbs work, more specifically, incandescent light bulbs. So, the two most commonly used light bulbs are the compact fluorescent light bulbs and the incandescent light bulbs. So, the light bulbs that you see most of the times these days are these energy efficient compact fluorescent light bulbs. So, in these light bulbs, you basically have a gas which you electrocute, then you'll have specific wavelengths of light or specific colors that you'll see. Now with the incandescent light bulb, there's basically a wire or a filament that you heat up, which starts to glow and um, turn about, you know, like a reddish hue. But today we're actually going to show you how to make one. What you need first is a battery pack uh, for double A's. You can pick this up at Radio Shack for $2. You're going to need some mechanical pencil lead. Uh, fun fact, not really lead, it's actually graphite made out of carbon. Alligator clips, which you can also get at Radio Shack. Alligator clips because they re resemble an alligator's jaw. And probably a couple of sheets of paper and some tape, and we'll get going. So, a conductor is defined as a material able to transfer electrons quite easily. Now, graphite or pencil lead is sort of a conductor. It does pass electrons quite easily, but in between, it actually bashes around and causes it to lose its energy through heat and light. And as a result, when we pass electricity through mechanical pencil lead or graphite, you'll see it start getting warm and produces a lot of light. Nugget of Knowledge! So, what you're going to do is make some paper donuts out of uh, sheets of paper that you have, tape it up, and add the two alligator clips onto it. So this way you're going to have a little prop, okay? Two alligators, jaws, and going back and forth. Ah! Oh. Good. No, that one's in for sure. <laughs> now that you have your battery pack ready and your little nifty stand done, take the two alligator clips, red and black, and connect them through the red and black wires of your battery pack. But before you do that, make sure your switch is on the off position. You don't want to go burning yourself or doing something bad, because that's no good. Once you grab a piece of lead, you want to stick it between the jaws of your alligator clips. And when you do this experiment, always hold this by the paper, all right? And make sure you hold it at a tilt. When you're ready, you're gonna turn the switch on. Make sure you still stay somewhere very well ventilated because it's gonna start smoking. And kids, make sure you do this with a parent nearby. It's gonna take about 30 seconds or more, but you'll see that it's gonna start glowing. If you want, you can always add a nice cup around it so it looks like a light bulb. I don't know if you can see it now, but it's starting to glow. And this is basically how incandescent light bulbs work. So what you guys can try at home is maybe vary the different thickness of your pencil lid. So 0 0.3, 0 0.5, 0 0.7. And you can actually put your old graphite inside different colored uh, cups and you'll get different kinds of light. So if you like this, don't forget to comment down below, hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and we'll see you next time. Look at knowledge! That were we recording now? Oh, I'm, I gotta save this. I'm unrecording this.